I was surprised to hear from you again. Well, I heard you had a job you couldn't do on your own. Well, what makes you think I want you on, Lord? Well, from what I hear, you ain't got a lot of choice. You know, you lose a lot of trust from people once you start kidnapping their kids. So how come you still want to work with me, then? Well, maybe I believe in second chances. Is that right? So what's got nothing to do with you needing the cash to buy this place? I know you need some money moving from a warehouse. I know you need to do it soon before the old people work out what's going on. But if I've heard about it, it's only a matter of time before they work it out or not. You really do need the cash for us, don't you? Well, that ain't your business, is it? Oh, yeah, it is. If I can help you get it. Keep talking. Thing is, I'm here. The Mitchells ain't what they used to be. I've had my uh, ear to the ground, so to speak. He's lucky, really. Made to get the parking space around London these days. That blue badge will come in real handy. Ben ain't your concern. You'll be dealing with me, yeah? Sure. And Minnie Mitchell always does what Daddy says. Tell you about our little meet up, did he? Had a neat little car job I was going to do with him. Wasn't right for it, though. Not after he had to get his copper boyfriend to translate everything for him. The boyfriend wouldn't be a problem. No, you're right. He wouldn't be. Because I don't wear with people who get into bed with the filth. So do you want our help? Or not? Hmm? This isn't a job for the liability like your son. Phil Mitchell's gay, deaf son. Ben's a joke. Couldn't fight his way out of a paper bag. No one will go near him now. So if you want in, you're going to have to do it alone. Do the job without Ben. Or not at all. Your choice. Oh, not here to check up on me, are you? Nah. I thought maybe he was here as my sponsor. Right. Everything all right? Yeah, just come and check on our agreement. About buying this cafe. Yeah, well, obviously. I'm getting everything sorted out of my head. Good. It's a good thing that way. Well, they're still teased across and eyes to dot. Is there a problem? No, no, no problem, is there, Will? No. Good, because I've got a meeting about some business now. She put me in a bad position. Well, we both want to get this done to get the readies, and it's a done deal, all right? This place is yours. The sooner the better. Pie, please, chicken. Take it your buying. I'll bring them over and all. Well, look, I'll get used to this. Oh, you might change your mind. Yeah, well, you're right. I do have a choice to make. <laughs> no one, no one has a pop of my boy and gets away with it. 